Hello everyone, it is 4 p.m. on Thursday the 15th of June 2023 and we are back with more Castlevania. Uh, on the last stream we made quite a bit of progress and found out that I had in unintentionally made the game much harder for myself by doing certain things out of order. Uh, <laughs> uh, well, uh, the... I'm still experimenting with some things on Twitch here. Uh, the default ad schedule is turning out to be an incredibly double-edged sword. Because I had two viewers here at the start, within the first few minutes of the stream. But they got hit with the mandatory 1 minute 30 second of ads per half hour or so. Uh, that disables pre-rolls for the remaining amount of time. And now I'm back down to one view. It is what it is. But you're not here to hear uh, me complain about Twitch and ads and other similar things. You're probably here for Castlevania. So let's just... Yes, I will always let the PS1 uh, sound play out. No, this is not up for negotiation. I will, however, skip the extremely loud uh, Konami intro, because uh, it's extremely loud. It's a little unfortunate, actually. I'm currently technically competing with... Uh, well, competing in giant air quotes with... Uh, a Symphony of the Night speedrunner I watch uh, called Jupiter Climb, who's doing randos right now, and uh, yeah, no, I'm not, I'm not stealing views from him. No, no, not, not a chance in heck. Uh, yep, off to a great start. Yep, off to a great start. So we're down in the catacombs, and I am extremely bad at this game, still. I, and my diagonal down attacks are... That is just a wall of fire. Gremlin, why are you like this? Would you please stop? Okay. You know, I didn't think this track was one of the ones we were going to immediately hear upon booting up the game. But, uh... <laughs> oops. I, I have a bad habit of using the tracks... Uh, using tracks from the game that we're going to hear very early on in the pre-stream stuff? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What you got for me, Slim? Oh, it's Legion, or Grand Falloon, rather. Uh, I'm gonna do the smart thing. And defense buff. Good lord. Yeah, it's just a wall of bodies. So you have to break the outer shell of Legion. Uh, would you stop that? Oh my god, there's... It's just a wall of naked dudes. I'm just gonna keep checking Axis and hope for the best. I don't think you have to break every part of Legion in order to get the, uh, get the core attackable. There we go. We're down to 55 hearts, though, so I may not have enough to properly attack the core. Oh! Also, the one thing, uh, Legion is sort of known for... Lasers! Why a random amalgamation of flesh has access to lasers, I will never know. Would you stop that? Hold on. 
we don't have daggers, obviously. I don't really have a good ranged option here to try and hit the core. Plus, I just do jack all for damage, but we have technically taken over 50, 50 uh, health so far. Shield run may not be the, the best choice for this one. You know what? I'm going to do something silly. Ow. Come on. I could probably get him with spirit, but... No, that, that really hurts, actually. That hurts a lot. Okay, I need to watch which little head is uh, popping up the laser so I don't take stupid damage. Darn it, I can't tell his hit what his hitbox is. His hitbox is just kind of yes. Stop throwing bodies at me, please. Uh-oh. Okay, be a little bit careful here. There we go. First try on Legion. And he doesn't have a second phase. Take our life max up. Uh, technically, I believe he's an optional boss. I, I don't think you actually had to fight him at all. But we'll find out very quickly. Also, once again, jerk move. Putting things in the room after fighting a boss. Okay, and for defeating him, we get the Mormigil sword. Dark Element, Strong versus Holy, 50 attack power, which is more than a shield rod, but um, I've kind of learned by this point, stacking defense with how I play is uh, not an unreasonable stra strategy. And it doesn't look like there's anything, uh, any breakables. So, onward. Yep. You could jump back out of the room, or you could just, you know, fly, if you're like me, and decide, oh, hey, I'm going to just completely break intended progression. Okay, I'm gonna save after that, and I guess now we backtrack and try and go through... Yeah, there's an area off to the right that we never entered. And there's one back up towards the abandoned mine. Plus, we have the entire rest of the canal area, I guess you could call it. Okay. Ow. Well... Would have been a damage boost. <laughs> Discus Lord. What? Why did I lose speed? Okay. Um, I don't know... Oh, right, red skeletons. I need to not break these. Uh... Right, stopwatch. We don't need the stopwatch. I'll wait for it to fade. Oh boy, slimes. Um, if memory serves, there's something weird with slimes that you... Uh, what? Oh, I know exactly what this... 
animals can live in complete darkness. Thank you, fairy. I, I was already aware. Also, if you accidentally run into the spikes at all, you get knocked out of bat form and then uh, pain. Uh, and that lights it up. <laughs> Wear skeleton. You guys look so silly. Oh. Nope. Give him my axe back. And then we have two cross shurikens, which I'm remembering them being called buffalo stars for some reason. Oh boy. Oh. Wow. Okay. Now he died. I don't know why I switched to bat there. I think I was trying to go wolf and my my brain is just not functioning properly today. They're, they're both on right trigger and bumper, so... Or R1, R2, depending on how you want to call it. Hmm. Spike Breaker! Oh, I know exactly what this is for. Yep, Spike Breaking Armor. Uh, also, this restores our int while only being one defense less than uh, the walk armor for now. Oh, I'll put that on. Use that. Wrong form. Okay. Oh. Uh -oh. You know what? I'll take it. Also, I just realized, I don't think you can get back out without a uh, double jump slash... Was there anything locking you out of this room? Otherwise? Yeah, because other if you get down there without double jump or bat, then wait, no, normally you wouldn't you literally would not be able to get through this uh this room without bat. So, never mind. But yeah, we get the spike breaker. So now we can open that one door in uh chapel. That, uh, knocked us out of bat last time. Okay. For some reason, I thought there was something weird with slimes that they could not be killed by certain means. Or normal means. Uh, check for breakables. I've got a weird feeling about this room. Never mind. There's nothing on the map. What the heck? Oh, I'm totally going to get hit in the head by that. Or not. Uh, the other part of Bone Arc is just panicking, so we'll leave him be. Oh. Nope. No? Why are there two sub-weapons in this room? Okay, I need to backtrack. Oh, come on. Are we really doing this? Stupid gremlins. Right. Ow. <laughs> what do you do? Oh, right. I thought I had salt. That's why. We lost salt getting here. Trying to go to wolf. Uh, right. That's a save point. I think we're good. I don't think we need to constantly be saving anymore. I do need to const uh, stop constantly switching into bat, though. That's probably a, a reasonable strategy. Alright, we're back in the abandoned mine. So now we need to hit the area up and to the right. 
Also, the music here is quite a bit louder than the uh, track down in Catacombs. Oh. Gosh, Saya. Oh, no, no, no. I am failing at basic platforming now, too, so that's joy. Alright. And let's see what we have here. Oh, it's just a teleporter. Well then. I suppose in that case, we need to find... We need to go back up into the waterway. We need to activate the, the ferryman so that he actually... Uh appears in some of the later areas of it. And then we need to go to the right there. We're looking for one very specific item which opens up the entire second half of the game. Because you need to defeat a hidden boss to do so. Of course, we're also on the lookout to regain salt, but that's not exactly mandatory. One thing I definitely need to do is just let the music ride from time to time, instead of constantly talking. Especially when the music is this high quality. Even even some of the more repetitive tracks like that one uh, are still really good. Uh, uh, code. Okay, I should be able to just wolf. No, I said I should be able to just wolf. D-pad, rain, D-pad. Oh god. This could be bad. I don't know if I want to be down here right now. Nope. No, 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 no. Ow, ow, ow. We are still, in fact, water-soluble. Wrong. Yep. This was not what we were looking for, I think. I know this does reopen, or this does open the shortcut back to the entrance hall of the castle, so there's that. I also could have sworn there was another boss fight we're missing around here, too. Yeah, this is the entrance hall. Uh, back door. Hit that, and there you go. Door open. And you get a life max up for your trouble. Can't break this weird purple flame, though. There you are. I'll take you to a place which might be interesting for you. <laughs> okay. So this should just unlock the ferryman in general from here on. Which should mean that now we can go all the way to the right. And pass that one gate we couldn't open before. Okay. Might be another zone transition too, I'm not 100% sure. Oh! Merman statue! 
What? Ah. <laughs> uh. No, we're still water soluble. So what? What did that relic do? What, what did it do for us? Summons the oarsman. Oh no, that just literally. Okay, that's what we were looking for, kinda. I wasn't aware it was a relic. Also, hey, Chocobo. I don't know if I said that already. I take a sip of my drink while we have a long auto scroller. Water soluble. Ow. Um. <laughs> Not what I wanted. That hurt. Cool. A life max up, but we have to take a significant amount of damage to actually get to it. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, and now we fly. I can't get... I, I swear there's a room, like, in the middle of this waterfall, but we can't get to it. It's a breakable wall. Um, oh, boots. We can't get those either, for reasons that should probably be obvious. I've already been on the other side, so switch to wolf and dash time. Not what I wanted. Ow, 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 ow. It's all the salt. Uh, Alucard has just become salt. Therefore, he is water-soluble. Oh, no! That's a problem. But then again, we have enough health. Do I risk it? Screw it. Oh, there is nothing down there. Totally a worthy endeavor. Alright, back to puppy dashing. I still don't remember why this box is here. I suspect it's because they... Yeah, the box is there because they don't expect you to have double jump in this area. There is a little section down there. I don't know if you guys could see it. But there's what looks like Tanfa there. And I guess you would have to go underwater somewhere or there's a breakable wall here somewhere. No? Whoop. I can't remember 100%. I'll figure it out once we're once we can actually safely go in water. Oh. I'll guide you to meet your destiny. That voice is... <laughs> I, I don't know where they got half of these voice actors, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, there's something up there, too. Ow. No! No! Come back! Uh, yes. Uh, it is. This is the Crystal Cloak, I believe? Oh, I missed, I missed his exit line, if he had one. Oh no. Ow. Ow. We are missing like 150 health. The holy symbol. We are no longer water soluble. And just to confirm. 
Oh, not not all of you. Where is it? Holy symbol. Protection wall underwater. And immediately... Oh, what? No. I'm good. Oh, hey, an elixir. We'll just hoard those and never use them ever. Okay. We're still looking for one item. I don't know if it's even in this area. We might have needed to get the Spike Breaker armor. I'm not sure. I think the Spike Breaker armor is optional too. This isn't like Bloodstained where it is 100% required to progress. Oh, really? Just a heart? Oh, got another potion drop from the uh, bat, though. Every one of those is an extra 50 HP we can burn on doing absolutely stupid things. Ah, here we go. Life Max. Anything else? No? Yes. A knuckle duster, which we got from the frogs. Again, why the frog has bra brass knuckles, I will never know. But while we're here, we have one more target, because I want to get into that room with the Tanfa. Since it's not a breakable here, we should now be able to go in the room that has... Oh. Wait. How does that work? Yeah. I will choose that however I have to. Okay, yeah, it's down here. Wow. Wibbly water physics. Gotta love them. And fish pillars. Ow, jerk. Stop with that. They're they're visibly Tanfa, but they're Unchaku. Strike the enemy twice, two handed. So double tap, but it's both hands, I guess. I don't think those even have much range. And our shield rod is better for a variety of reasons. I'll probably give some of these weapons a poke later. And just see if any of them are useful. But I think outside of clearing some map squares, we've just about finished up this area. Which is a bit concerning. Because... That means that we're running out of places for this item to be. I... Wait, I haven't gone up to the right from the clock tower. Oh. I didn't fill in the squares here. More fish heads! And... Questionable water physics that launched me halfway across the known universe. Yeah, that was with me still inputting a left input. I was launched that far. It's significantly less uh, fall or uh, knockback if you're crouching, but. Oh, nope. oh. Nope. Uh, I lost whatever that one dropped. It looked like a poison resist or something. Anti-venom there. Oh, a resist ice. And another life max up. We're actually getting up there in terms of uh, max life. The water is concentrated Castlevania physics. Yeah, it also explains why Alucard was weak to it without the, uh, without a holy symbol, which, uh, 
It's a bit questionable that Alucard is able to carry a holy symbol in the first place. You know, vampire and all. And depending on your vampire lore. Alright, we want to go back down the waterfall now. After I grab this. Yes, it's just a pentagram, but still. Uh, I wonder if we'll still get knocked out of bat form. We will. But, we did get the secret boots. What do they do? Discreetly increases height. I have no idea what that what those that's actually supposed to do. Other than what it says on the tin. Uh-oh. Uh, can I be cheeky? No, I cannot. Oh. Yeah. I, I suppose our only trick here, our only move here, is to go all the way back up to uh, library, because we have five library cards might as well so library card take a warp somewhere uh go check the one spike room because that's about the only thing i can think of we do have, still have access to uh the other side of the clock room which i'm going to have to deal with Man, this is still so incredibly inconvenient to get out of. Alright, puppy mode activate. Alright. We. Well, now we have to get into this room. Puppy mode again. Uh, and we bounced off the... I hate that you just bounce off the wall. Okay. Now we take the elevator up one floor. Because... We... Wow, there is really not much in the way of convenient exits. I guess we take the warp over to the final area. Final boss area. Excuse me. And then run all the way back through over to chapel. Yep. Actually, that was the first warp we got. I'll take it. Oh, right. this is going to knock us right back out because we went through a door transition. Oops. Darn it. We. Ow. Okay, another door transition. Yay. Yep, we drop down here. And to think, these guys were giving us so much trouble not too long ago. Man, that is a heck of a painting. Darn it. I was not dashing long enough. Ah, screw you, bird. And again, I swear you could fly up into one of these bells and get an item, but I can't remember which one. And I don't have the patience to fly up into every single uh, bell. Okay. Ah.
the noise of the spike spikes breaking. Oh. So, did you find Richter? I don't know if he's the one you're looking for, but I found a Belmont. Really? So he is here. But the one I saw was the enemy. He was the lord of this castle. That can't be true. You're wrong. I, I, I must go now. And... Oh, yep, there it is. Uh, one moment. Oh. I kept having things pop up on my, uh... Twitch dashboard, and, uh... It was making me think something was going on. But no, it was Twitch saying, Oh, hey, you can now, uh... Manually play a 30-second ad break. No. No, I, I will not. Okay, so we now have the silver and gold rings. Which were exactly what we were looking for. Um... It's gonna do that anyways, you're not wrong. If I could remember where the salt was. Ow. If I could remember where the salt was, uh, we could just grab that and be on our way. Can I puppy dash through? Wait, did the puppy dash just break the spike ball? Huh. Okay, we have not saved in a while, and I do mean a legitimate while, like 10 to 15 minutes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a safety save here, and now we move on to the next section. Because our target has no convenient teleports too close to it. There, There is one we could use, but it's still... Getting to another teleporter to use that teleporter is going to be a trip. So just enjoy the music, right? Dog cannot pass through blue doors. So it is written. Yes, I did find... I also found Bat. I can also put in, an, put in a Hadouken motion as a uh, dog and make... Uh, uh, do a short dash on Wolf. Which is not nearly as impressive, but worth mentioning. Um, yeah. Axe is better than the Reflector Jewel. My, my names for things keep changing. Why a random axe armor was carrying 50 bucks, I'll never know. Wait, not you. Um, I could have sworn the salt was around, was it here, or was it somewhere else? That's fine. I suppose the era of salt is over. Now, did we enter this room at the appropriate time? All Roxas quarters is up, are open, but uh, it's not exactly what we need. So I think we have to wait. I don't know how long we have to wait. 
Is it even minutes, odd minutes, or... I honestly can't tell you. But I want to get that... Okay. Um... Well, Horrox's cores are open on an even minute. That's the thing. Or does it just exchange every other even minute? Yeah, 5706. So I guess it exchanges. Nope, need an item? Really? Well, this isn't convenient. Wait, where's the gold ring? Oh, we do have the gold ring. So we put both of those. Also, I just noticed that straight up is accessible because we can fly. Okay. There we go. Nah, I'm good. Well, 6.30, Dracula's uh, pizza is free. Ha. Uh, this looks needlessly menacing. Oh. Gravity boots. Yep, down up jump for a super jump. We are in the effective endgame. And over here, we have a potion, a hammer, and a life apple. Uh, the hammer was also somewhere in... Uh, it's where we got the damage tracker. Ah, I don't want to fall down yet. Also, all Rox's quarters, yeah, all Rox's quarters are uh, open again, so... Not much we can do about that, I guess. And to the left is a save point, because we are about to fight a boss. So Ring of Pales goes on, and I guess Mystic Pendant again. So what's weird is, I swear another game in Ca the Castlevania series used this room style. I want to say it was, uh... I want to say it was Harmony of Dissonance. Maybe not this exactly, but it was close. Okay. Alucard? That voice, Maria? I'm sorry. You were right. He has joined forces with the enemy. So it was a Belmont after all. But someone must be controlling him. Whatever we do, we can't harm Richter. But he must be stopped. I know. Well, here. Take these with you. What are these? If you wear these, you can see beyond evil illusions. Thank you. Tis best then if you pray for the soul of your friend. Um... Okay, this was not what I thought it was. Weird, I could have sworn... I could have sworn there was a boss fight in this room. Like, that was supposed to be where you fought Shaft. Oh. Hold on. Ugh. So, uh, I'm really glad that later games give you just a direct shortcut to the gravity boots, whatever you want to call them. Because, who oh boy, is it annoying to use in practice. Especially if you have to chain them. So I suppose with that, Unless we were supposed to immediately put on the holy glasses and see that there was something in the room with Maria. I don't know. 
I could be wrong. I probably am. Oh. Okay, what's going to be the easiest way? Technically going up to Aurox's quarters. Oh, it's closed. Oops. Well, screw it. Puppy does not have hops. Sorry, I'm I'm kind of doing mental mental math here and trying to keep track of what all we need to do based on what I remember. We're very much in a state of it was a calculated gamble, but boy, am I bad at math. You know? Alright, I need to go down one over to the right, and then I should have a clear shot straight to the... the tower and elevator and all that stuff. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not really feeling the best today. I, I didn't cancel stream because schedule is schedule. But, uh, some things are very much not sitting well with my stomach right now. Uh, nah, all the way up is the best mover. Uh, maneuver for us. Because we take this warp, we go over to the final boss area again. And then we go fight the quote-unquote final boss, who's not actually the final boss. Keep pushing the wrong button. Okay, that's not it. So, it, it is exceptionally annoying to try and get the stupid gravity boots to work out the time. Again, Ari of Sorrow fixed this problem by just having you push left bumper. But then again, Arya also didn't have 5 billion shapeshift forms that you had to juggle, so, you know. Yep. Alright. Going to switch out for the cross here. Oh, and a heart max up I could have grabbed. And now, I need to put on... The Holy Glasses, which are less defense, sadly. Uh, did I save? I don't remember if I saved. Oh. I've been waiting for you. Answer me. Why is a Belmont planning the resurrection of Count Dracula? Count Dracula rises but once every century, and my role is over. If I can resurrect him, then the battle will last for eternity. If those are your true feelings, then so be it. Yeah, no. I'm good. Ow. So... We need to completely ignore Richter for the most part. And smack that orb instead. Ow. But yeah, Richter is a pain in the rear to fight. As he quite frankly should be. I'm gonna pop my defense buff here. 
I'm getting juggled. I'm a pop some healing actually. Oh. Um. Hey, got any grapes? Let's see. New York style pizza. I'm pretty sure New York doesn't exist right now. When did we get that? I'm not really sure when we got the Herald Shield. It's also better than our shield or uh, better than our Night Shield. Uh hold on. Turkey. I threw the turkey off screen. Oh, good lord. Okay. The turkey is gone. And now... I have to hope we don't die a horrible, painful death. There we go. You've defeated me, but all is not yet lost. The resurrection of Count Dracula is at hand. <laughs> No. What have I done? Thank you, Alucard, for saving Richter. Alucard? The same Alucard who fought alongside my ancestor, Trevor Belmont? That was over 300 years ago. No time for small talk. Is the person who controlled you in that castle over there? Yes, I think so. Maria, take Richter and leave here. I'll finish this. All right. Good luck. Also, I don't have control over Alucard right now. He just walked over on his own and entered the Inverted Castle. So, uh, the Inverted Castle is exactly as it sounds. It's the castle we just fought through, but upside down. With some more differences that we'll get into. It's also about the point where the game gives you the finger and just says, yeah, no. Um, you wanted a difficulty spike? Here's a difficulty spike. Ooh, excuse me. Okay, Stone Mask is only one defense more, and we now have the Herald Shield, so... We... Oh, not why why Go into bat. There we go. So, we also lost our map. Uh, with the... Changes. But most things will be in a very similar place. Oh. And for completing that fight and going back into the hidden room here, uh, the staircase that was ac accessible to both Richter and Alucard in the normal castle, we get two life max ups and a heart max up. Oh, make that two heart max ups, and a third life max up, and and another one. Oh, and a new cape, the Royal Cloak. It is significantly better. Two additional con, uh, 
one additional defense. And it's no longer Chroma Keyed. Instead, it's just blue. Which I'm okay with. Uh oh. Oops. Hold on. Experiencing technical difficulties. There we go. Yeah, the fun part is going to be basically getting everything or getting into all the rooms that we had already opened. Oh, Iron Ball. Oh no, it's a Skull Lord. Well, he died like a pansy. Also, is it just me or did the moon change phase in the background? I could have sworn it was full before. Um, I am trying for the life of me to remember where things are. There should be a room down here. But, buddy, you can just pick up your skull. That's fine. You, you don't have to keep kicking it. But also, the skull tracks as an enemy itself. Ah, alas, poor Yorick. I knew him. Okay, and... Unfortunately, this room doesn't have 5 billion, uh... 5 billion life max ups as well. It's just, uh, element resists. And ailment resists. <laughs> and a high potion. It's a potion, but high. Been hitting the good stuff. Boing. Boing. Uh oh. Nope. I want to fly into this room. And then if we go across here, it is still a save room. And for some reason, the prism falls down to the bottom of the room for you to be able to save instead of staying up there. I, I don't know why the prism is so accommodating. Or, well, it's a D20, I believe, but... There you go. Now, uh, yep. It falls down to the top of the room. Yeah, shush. Okay. Uh, we should still be able to get up from here. No? Is this just going to be a hard wall? No, we can still get through it. Um, I don't remember if there's anything over here. I suppose we'll find out. As sad as it is, uh, Chocobo, I don't get the reference, so I don't know which which accent I should be using for that one. Oh. A garnet. I'm hearing explosions. Which sounds like it's going to be fun in a room or two. Ah, Red Letter Media. Okay. Well, I don't know if there's any breakables here, so I'm going to assume not. Uh-oh. Nope. I guess we continue on. Ooh, what are you? Lightning mail. You know what I just noticed is kind of missing from Alucard's arsenal? That's also sort of a staple. Uh, Alucard doesn't have access to the Lizard Tail for the uh, slide kick. Or if he does, I never found it. Oh. I have been cursed. Uh, what? Did, did I just... I didn't... Does Alucard not have access to the... 
Yeah, that's what I was saying. I didn't know how... how this, no, that just ain't right. <laughs> My poor fairy is working overtime. Okay, I have no clue. I'm for some reason it's not letting me use my uh it's not letting me use my sub weapon even. What am I even supposed to break them with? Oh my. Uh the Herald Shield is element resist and summons a uh summons a lady with well, questionable clothing. Yeah, demonetized. <laughs> You're not wrong. Okay, they only have like 5 HP. Alright, what do we have this way? Well, I... The CD room icon is upside down now, too. Ah, where am I even going? Well, I've obtained Magic Missile again. Darn it. It's the stupid uh, jellyfish from... What's it called? Uh, uh, oh, no. Uh-oh. So, the Black Panthers do have an item that I kind of want, if memory serves. The problem is actually managing to kill them with our current equipment. I have no idea. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We'll be fine, right? We, we saved a while ago. Um, what do I have healing-wise? I have potions. I have peanuts. Difficult to eat. According to the description. Restores about half HP. Neat. I need to resort my items here. I... AC, are we really doing this? Uh, hold on. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll just use the Herald Shield. Alright. Oh! Oh no! I have been stoned! <laughs> my, uh, my fairy just pulled out a giant hammer and smashed the stone. We're doing a rather pathetic amount of damage right now. I think she's, uh, blunt resist. Not a particularly hard boss, though. Not gonna lie. You know what? Yeah. I'm just gonna switch over to a, a sword here and see if that helps. What do we have? S-Stock is 51... I suppose that stock seems to be our best bet. Unless I want to use something a little bit more fancy. 
Oh, it's a two-hander. Oh, boy. Ooh. Oh, that's weird. Uh, it sort of dashes us forward when we use it. Okay, I'm going to have to use another healing item. Green tea! Uh-oh. Only restored 10 health. Oh boy, this could be bad. Uh, uh, pot roast. Pot roast is 50. Um, not going to continue using that. Let's see, second best option for weapon. I guess break out the ice brand. And then shield and offhand again. Ooh, yeah, that was... That was, uh, pretty smooth. Oh, obtained Heart of Vlad. Which is an indicator that, yep, one of five tre treasures avoid curse. Um, shield Rod Special Attack. Yeah, I know about the Shield Rod Special Attack. Ooh. Ice Brand also has a special attack, it looks like. Also, the stupid Black Panther keeps uh, dodging me. I couldn't even see what I killed. I cast Flashbang. Um... Oh, you were referring to the little, like, uh, wheel projection thingy. Okay. Uh, and we have the Talwar. Another Indian sword. Nope. Nope. Come on. So hard to do anything with these stupid uh, gravity boots. Ah. And for some reason, now that the castle's flipped, my brain is just completely forgetting everything. Uh, salt! You came back! We have reobtained the salt! Our lord has not forsaken us! <laughs> oh, that that's a dying animation. But yeah, I honestly do not remember what the Black Panthers dropped. I just know that I kind of need it. Uh, I would salt the cat, except something's kind of missing. Namely, hearts. Oops. Wait, can we... We, we can kill Black Panther by puppy dashing. We can farm Black Panther by puppy dashing, I just realized. Oh, break, please. Thank you. Hey, life max up, so we get a full heal. And a monoprism. Hmm. I think we might have automatically gotten it just now. That's the funny bit. I might have to sort through my inventory again. Hi potion. Tower, Mormagill. Yeah, I couldn't tell you. I know we got I if I could remember what it was they dropped, it might help, but like I don't at all. Oh, you're fancy.
Isn't it convenient that we can just go through this room? Because we... Oh. Oh, we got one cape upgrade, and now it looks like we get another. The Twilight Cloak. And it is, once again, more constitution, more defense. A black cape for vampires. And I'm not sure, but I think this is the cape we started with. Maybe not, though, because I don't remember it having the uh, pulsing red. All right, puppy dash, go! It did not work. Oh my good god, that is 40 damage. Why do you hurt so much? Why do you hurt so much? Why is this necessary? Uh, I wonder if there's anything in the upside down confessional. Biblically accurate damage. You're probably not wrong there. Okay. And, oh, why is there just a horde of these? They die in one hit, but they hit like a truck. No, please. I'm good. Hey, level up. We're probably going to start skyrocketing in levels now that we're uh, into the inverted castle. Okay, were you the confessional? No, that goes to the phantom sword. Oh boy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I did not sign up for a bullet hell. Okay, never mind. The confessional does nothing. And now we're here a third time. Oh. Ah, I'm getting possessed by the imps. Uh, if the imps stab you in the back, I believe. Wow, yeah, another level. If the imps stab you in the back, I believe they control you and just force you to attack repeatedly for a few seconds. Oh, hell no. Uh, nope. Nope, I'm good. I know you dropped something. I'm not interested at the moment, considering that is a lot of shields. Like, a lot of shields. That's too many shields. Uh, I don't know. Uh, uh nope. That's 40 damage. Just a casual 40 damage. No big deal. Where even am I? Where, where? Oh my god, no! There's too much! How do we reasonably expect you to keep up with this crap? What the crap? I, I don't know what I did. Oh. I accidentally did the input for Dark Metamorph- Or not Dark Metamorphosis, but uh... The Hellfire. Like, they die in one hit, but they deal 40 damage to you every time they clip you. And I've already been here. I took the wrong door out of that room. So, non-zero chance we have to go through that crap again. Alright, I'm taking this exit. I don't know where it goes, but I'm taking it. Why? Why are you like this, Castlevania? Alright.
I guess it's the time where we're just inching forward, hoping for our hoping for our lives here. Nope. 40 damage again. Seems to be a consistency. I do not have the HP to make it out of here. What do I have healing item wise still? <sighs> well, there's the elixir. I could use that. Wait, did my fairy use my high potion? Wow, the grapes are a grand total of five points of healing. Screw it. Let's see what let's see what Castlevania thinks of a New York style pizza. Twenty one. Pizza, uh, less filling and healing than pot roast, confirmed. Okay, that's a hundred. Ugh, oh, I'm sorry for constantly resaying the music, but, like, holy crap. No! Yes! We're in a very bad spot, but I will take this for the opportunity to heal and not lose a massive amount of progress. I think I'm doing that thing where I just accidentally break out of intended progression again. Alright, dude. Lev levitate down so I can see. Oh. I do no damage to him. Hmm... Ow. Ow. Well, this is a problem. Uh... What the heck? How do we get a thousand gold drop off of that? Uh, please stop. Okay, I'm leaving. No, I, I said I'm leaving. Let me out. Let me out. Uh, I mean, the music is appropriately menacing, too. But I don't want to be here right now. And the, and the music's also giving me anxiety, not gonna lie. Oh, hey, right, there's the Buffalo Star. If we get the duplicator, we can just completely break the speed run, I believe. I don't remember if they still use that trick. I remember for a while there, it was something... I wanted to say it was duplicator Buffalo Star. Oh, what the crap. Okay there, Blanca. Darn it, I just get launched out of the room and then everything I did is nullified. No, I, I, I can't. I don't have the damage to break into that room. And there's probably something good on the other side, too. Ow. Um, I'm gonna heal at the save point again. I think it's justified under the, con uh, under the circumstances. Ugh. Um, not gonna lie, we might need to level grind here. I I wish I was joking, but we might need to level grind. Oh, come on. Because if we're getting levels every kill or two off of these uh, off of these enemies, we are massively underpowered for what we are trying to fight. Um... Oh boy. Boss fight. Oh. That doesn't look menacing at all. As a grawl. 55 damage. And I'm getting jungled. I'm 
Oh no, there's more than one. What? She fairy revived me? That's new. This is my fairy is best girl. Um Oh no. Oh no. Nope. I know what that is. I'm not doing it. Also, for some reason, I thought it was in Waterway. Oh no, Blanca. That's a heck of a death animation. He just falls off the screen. Never mind. Also demonetized on Twitch again, considering they turned back into a normal dude upon death and burst into flames. Why do you get to slide kick and I don't? Seems a little unfair. Ugh. Oh. Um... Why are there so many... Wait, why is there another save point over here? But no, what I was saying was, why are there so many, uh... Uh, bone dragons? It's kind of getting silly. Yes, yes, you like doing your Mr. Wiggles impression. Oh, hey! Life Max up! Heart Max! More Heart Max! And we're back into the middle. We've been on the other side of this room. Okay. Which means there's nothing in there. So I can completely ignore it for the rest of time. Got it. Uh-oh. Sword. Ram. Are you better? Are you better than this sword? No. But is the sword formerly named Graham? I don't remember if it does anything fancy. But that's weird. That the ice brand is just so much better than half the weapons we're picking up, even going into Inverted Castle. Ow! Why did that have to hurt so much? Oh. Okay. No? No. I want in here. I will probably come to regret this decision here in a moment. Yep, because Bone Dragon. Ah! Puppy invincibility frames! Wait, I can use... I can use mist to safely pass through some of this and completely cheese things out. Okay, we have a strategy for getting things we aren't supposed to. As long as my magic lasts, that is. Um, there is an area off to the right we could hit, but I think I want to go down and ex uh, hit that zone transition. I'm, uh, let these guys go. Let them off with a warning. Okay. Why? Why would you put that here? No. Okay, puppy dashing is quite literally saving us right now. Um, uh, memory serves. Not the button I wanted to hit, but I'll take it. Luck potion. I don't 
actually know if those are permanent or not. I doubt it. I think they're just temporary buff items. Mana Prism. Uh, I do have the Spike Breaker. Yeah, they're temporary. I figured. Um, these Ghost Dancers aren't really doing much because we have, we still are using the Spike Breaker armor, so we can deal with them at our own speed and kind of ignore the trap in the room, or traps in the room. Uh, what the heck was even all of this? Hi, Malthus! What are you doing here again? Why are there two of you? Why did they turn bosses into normal enemies for Inverted Castle? Oh my god, that's three! Three! Three, Malthus! Ah, 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 get that... Okay, later. I, I guess that's it from him. Ow. Um. Pick up the shuriken. Back to puppy. Puppy dash for safety. Uh, why am I trying to... Wait. I have a bad feeling. Uh. Okay, Akmudan the second. Is there Is there a phase two or Don't worry, I'm just going to salt the mummy. He seems particularly weak to it. Huh? Oh. Yeah, that's... Um... Hmm. Phase two? No, this. Obtain the rib of Vlad. And that one is... Con plus ten. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna- I'm not gonna take the stupid death where I can dodge it. Thank you. And an extra heart max up. He gives you the pile driver. Oh boy. Is there another bottom exit from this room? No? Is that it? Wow. That was kind of pointless then. Making you come out all this way just for one of the relics? I don't know about that one. Okay, I have been down there, so I guess bat mode and... Dodge, dodge the crows. Oh no, Medusa heads too. Are you kidding me right now? Oh, there's a save point. I guess we're back to my habit of saving every five minutes because uh, things hurt and will kill us. I probably should just stay in bat mode. I don't remember where Jack all is. Oh, we have a room. 
Oh, that doesn't look horrifying at all. Flying zombie. What the heck? No. I refuse. I'm I'm good. Thank you. Why is he here too? That was labeled as Cthulhu. Or Cthulhu, rather. Don't even know what that does. The, uh, Frostbrand special. Oh, hey, it's a, it's a Light Max. I'll take that. Makes this mildly worthwhile. Why? Why do you exist? Please stop existing. I am... I am politely requesting. Alright. We'll do more a more in-depth exp exploration once I feel like I'm not going to get ganked every two seconds. Oh, this just links up here. Well, crap. Um, there's an area all the way over to the right on a lower platform here that I have not explored. We have not found a single teleporter room yet. Uh-oh. Nope, we're not doing that. I refuse. Thank you. Wait, no, this was just the spike breaker room, wasn't it? Yep. That's a problem. Wow, my magic damage fell off hard. Okay. Um, with that being ruled out, then... There's an area past... What's his name? Uh, the upgraded Spectral Sword, or whatever it is, that I can kill. Ow. Still 11 contact damage against that one. Oh, what the... Owie. Guess I'm gonna have to take the slow fly up. Wait, why did he de-summon and re- Oh, no. No, no, no. What's... What's the button? Uh... Sure. Not what I wanted. Come on, ow. Well, I'm getting levels. I'm also getting pain. Uh, and that was an armor drop that I just lost. I'm not sure if that was from the snipers or something else. Okay. We're in relative safety. Uh... Oh. He hasn't aggroed yet. You know what? I feel perfectly justified in my cheese. Please hit the main body. If I knew how to do the Tetrasols, that would probably be even better, but... Oh, hey, a Night Shield. Isn't that familiar? Ow. 
Wow, all that and all we got was 25 cents. Well, dollars, but it feels like 25 cents. In this day and age, in this economy, $25 might as well be 25 cents for all it gets you. Oh no, no, why? Why? Oh hey, fire boomerang. That sounds neat. No, 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 no. Ow. I forget that shields actually block projectiles. I think it has a surprisingly long range, considering. Oh, I just realized the Neely Knights aren't here, because we're in the uh, inverted tower. What in the actual heck? I... Can't tell you if this is better or worse than the Neely Knights. Just a generic archer. Okay. Yeah, well, I'm not going to question it too hard. A diamond. Oh, look, more TNT. Wow. Uh, these guys might be worse to fight than the uh, actual Neely Knights were on level. Well, I say on level, and we kind of broke progression. Oh, no. I need to get out of here. Thank you, Heart Max. There's a save point at the end of this. If we can get there, then we're then we're fine. Zircon. Okay, fly up. Take the free heart max because it's a free heart max. And save. For the love of all things holy, save. Whew. Apologies, I needed to take a sip of my drink. My throat's getting a little rough, considering we're later into the stream. And this should be... Yeah, this is the back half of uh, Alchemy Lab. Oh, I just realized something probably moved into Slogger and Gaibon's room, didn't they? Um... Oh. Well, I can live with fighting those. Not the worst thing in the world. Another save point. I'm not going to use that one considering how close our last one was. But I am going to note its existence. Considering we are running low on time, quite frankly. What in the heck? Oh no, floor traps! Gremlins! Why? This is where the game just kinda is out to get you. Ow. Ugh, so many flames! And random imps still messing with us. Uh, no, we want to go down here, I think. Ow, the, the stupid floor trap hits for 48. I just, I just wanted to mention that. Um... Life Max! We're almost to 400 health already. 
Nope, not why I needed. Oh, I just realized, uh, because we're using the ice sword, it deals it deals a crap ton to uh the gremlins because they're ice weak. Uh, would you let me go, please? Thank you. What the Nope! No, please. I'm good. Ow. What the heck is even hitting me? Ow. Would you please stop wombo comboing me every time I try to get out of this area? Now there are two of them. Oh, well, we'll take that. Again, I never promised to be good at this game. I never promised to be good at any of the games I stream. I do my best, or for a given value of best, but... <laughs> Yeah, no promises. Okay. Another vertical climb. I can one-tap gremlins with this sword because it's ice. Salem witches, on the other hand, not so much. Also, I'm noticing the sword itself is just randomly double-tapping. It's definitely a nice effect. Ow. Ow. What in the unholy heck are you? Uh-oh. The lesser demons are back. And they're now a standard enemy as well. I'm getting really annoyed now. But it feels like I can't avoid damage. Is... No, he did just straight up summon another lesser demon. Wow. So note to self, kill them during that animation. Um... I don't remember 100% where I need to go... Level up. Um, oh. Well, crap. This is just another item room, I think. No, it is not. Oh, my brain is breaking. Yeah, so the fun part of this is... Okay. No worries, Sire. Yeah, the fun part of it, this is I have to climb up this freaking tower. Oh, the goddess shield. I have to climb up this tower while dodging the imps. Uh, goddess shield is perfectly even with the Herald Shield, as far as stats. So I have a stinging suspicion it just has a different Shield Rod effect. I'm not sure what, exactly. Okay, I'm just going to fall all the way down. Wait, no, if I take this rod, it'll just link up with... Will it? Will this just link up and go back to, uh, Royal Chapel equivalent? This is... 
Well, we got a save point regardless. I'll figure it out somehow. I actually have a rather nasty neck ache right now that's overpowering the headache meds I took before the stream. I might I might cut a little bit early. Like like I said, I've not been feeling the best today. But a schedule is a schedule. And if I do not keep my consistency up, I will find more and more reasons to just not push the stream button. I made this mistake. I made this mistake the last time, too. Okay. Uh, oh. Oh, right. Invisible enemies. Forgot about that. Well, not really invisible, but like only appears for a few frames, and you have to remember where the heck they are. Okay, turquoise. So we've got plenty of things to sell off to the uh, vendor, or the librarian guy. Alright, that's a zone change. Like I said, I think that just leads back into... That leads back into a place we've already been. And there's no other exits from this room. So I suppose we just go this way and see where it leads. Well, that's totally not menacing at all. And once again, the stone uh, skulls you cannot, you cannot break. Oh boy! And the gorgon we cannot uh, damage with salt efficiently. Ooh, Gorgon takes significant damage from either sword as a whole or ice specifically. Good to know. Oh, we're in the clock tower. Uh, Guardian. Ah, uh, that's... that's 91 damage. I'm good. We have 2 HP. Well, at least see what this is. Well, I know what this is. It's the other part of all rocks. Yeah, we don't need to be here. I don't even think there's any extra items here. Uh... Barry, I know you're freaking out. Please stop. We'll be fine. Maybe. Probably not. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna casually fly over all these enemies. Oh no. Okay. Uh, what do we have healing item-wise still? Now that we're past those guys? I just need something that will carry me to the next save point. Oh, the hot dog only heals 19. Wow. I saved all these healing items. And they do nothing of value. <laughs> uh, I think the, there's a risk of the uh, mushrooms poisoning us. For 56 HP is going to have to do. And then re-equip the goddess shield. Oh, no. I'm gonna have to keep a close eye on those traps. Oh, God, Nova Skeletons. Ugh.
No, no. Ah. Well, that was, I think, our only death of the stream, so, um, I'll call that good. Second? Oh, no, you're right, you're right. Oh. Yeah, you're, you're technically correct. Also, we are now at 124% map completion. So, for full map completion across both castles, it is 200%. Alright. Um, I did not go up and to the right from this one, I believe. He is the boss fight. This is the Sargoran Gaibon. Oh no, I remember exactly who's here. Behold! Yelzebub. And for best effects, we we stab his ankles. Until we can no longer stab his ankles. That's when things get complicated. Because we're now... We now kind of just have to tear him apart bit by bit and hope for the best. While he's deadly bullet helling at us. And those flies are doing 30 plus damage each. Oh, and there's random worms on the ground now. And those random worms deal stupid amounts of damage. Or they poison us, rather. Oh, sorry, I thought you were taken off. Nice to see you still, but like... And I can't salt him. The uh, Keeping the axe probably would have been better. Um, I have an idea. This idea is not working. I can't... Well, there's death number three because I completely and utterly failed the mobility check. I need to see if the axe is available. As much as I do like salt and, you know, salt for the memes, I kind of need something better. I think axe specifically will be our best bet. Now, the real question. No. Nope. No sub weapons in this room. Um. That's a problem. I'm thinking here. If I go back. I guess I could check through these rooms and see. Uh, I'm, I'm running out of ideas, quite frankly. We've got five minutes. Let's give it one more attempt with what we've got. Stupid plan number one. God, if these stupid worms didn't deal... Or if these stupid worms didn't poison us... Oh, 
And if the stupid flies didn't deal 37 damage each. Okay. I think I have a strategy. Or I would. Um. Oh my god, it's so cheesy and I love it. Salt, be our savior! Um, do I have any additional healing items? I doubt that's going to do anything to a boss. Uh, geez, we already established that all of those barely heal worth anything. Okay, I have an emergency heal on the elixir. I can... I can take basically one more hit. Oh, there are more hits. I got killed while popping the elixir. That is incredibly silly. Ugh. Unfortunately, though, I think we're out of time and this headache is getting the better of me anyhow, so I'm going to call it here. So, as always, thank you all for watching. I will be live again next week on Tuesday, uh, assuming I don't sneak in a uh, weekend stream. Background noise was thankfully acceptable today. Um, beyond that, though, as always, if you are new and you want to see more, you can either subscribe on YouTube for the VODs or uh, follow me here on Twitch. And if you want to support financially, I do have a Ko-Fi. It is not necessary, but every bit helps, and I am thankful for every ounce of money people donate. With that, um, I'm going to let the music rock for a little bit, and I'll see you all later. Until then, this is Rain, signing off. <laughs>